Hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Good evening, Tao. Good evening. Oh, wow, what an energy you've got tonight. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. Okay. Oh, where are you now? Are you at home? Yes. That's great. I see. Okay. Oh, I think there's someone's with you. Who is it? Is that your mom? Tao, can you hear me well? Yes. Okay, now let me rename my, my first. Can you see me well? Yes. That's good to know. <laughs> okay, Tao, welcome, welcome to Quantado class again. Okay, let me share my sound. Just wait for a second. It's gonna be okay. Can you hear the sound? Yes. Yeah, I like that sound. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hi, Tao. I miss you. Okay. Now I'm waiting for your homework. Would you, would you please send it? in the group chat okay yes okay thank you for that now let's go please look at the picture what do you see mm. Can you please tell me what do you see in the picture? There are many school things. Oh, there are many school things in the picture. Okay, very good. Can you tell me what are those? school things mm, they are um, book book pencil pencils color uh, crayons you mean yes okay okay no thank you now can you see a fish in the picture Yes. Great. Okay. <laughs> now, Thal, so, just look at it. What place is this? Look, there are chairs, tables. Blackboard, what place is this? Oh, you muted, you're muted. Yeah, say it again. Pardon me, Tao. It is a class. Yes. Yes, we can see desks. Um, where can we see chairs, books, crayons? In the 
in the in the class. Yeah, in the classroom. Okay. Now that is the title of our lesson. Unit nine in my classroom. Okay. Yes. Okay, very good. Now let's go. Let's look at the picture again. And please make a list of the objects in the classroom. Okay? Okay, oh, just tell me. Books, what else? Mm. Okay, let I will circle, you will say, okay? Yes. These are table. Yeah, so good tables. Computer. Very good. Bookshelf. Yes. Broad. Yeah. And this tiny white thing. Mm, chalk. <laughs> yeah. And this is like this one. Mm. Okay, let me clear because I think you're confused. What is it? It's a cupboard. Okay, all right, the cupboard or a drawer. Now this. These what are these? They are chairs. Chairs, very good. They are chairs. Okay, you say they are there. You go. They are chairs. chairs. Very good. Now that's it. Look, please read chalk board. Chalk, board, books, pants, bookshelf, clock. Okay, clock. Can you please circle the clock? <laughs> yeah, you got it. Very good, Tao. Okay, so that's it, Tao. Uh, in your classroom, though, can you see, oh, uh, there's no school right now, though? Am I right? You can go to school now because of the pandemic, right? Am I right? You can't go to school because it's pandemic? Now? Yes. No. Yes. See, now before, let's talk about your classroom before the pandemic, okay? Before the virus, all right? Yes. Okay, now can you please tell me what is in your classroom? Does your classroom have a chair? Mm, yes. How about table? Yes. Computer? No. No. Uh, board? Yes. It's a desk? Yes. How about aquarium? <laughs> oh, muted again. Oh, mute, you're muted. Oh, thank you. Mm. No. Oh, I see. 
All right. Okay, books. Yes. Okay, that's great. Okay, now let's go. Now here we're going to learn. Please read. Infinitive of um, purpose. Yeah, purpose. You? Purpose. Thank you. Please read. This is to explain why an atom is done. Okay, thank you. So it is used to explain why an action is done. Okay, again, read. It is used. It is used it. to explain. Okay, again, it. It is. It is used, used to explain when an action is done. Okay, very good on this part. Now, please read this. Why? 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 Okay, again, it is used. It's, it is it is used to explain why an action is done. Okay, cute thou. Okay, good. That's much. That is now infinitive of purpose is used to explain why an action is done. Okay? Now let's continue. For example, to has the same meaning as in order to. Okay? Yes. I write all the, the I write all the things in your classroom in order to know what is lacking, right? Now that is infinitive of purpose. To here explain why an action is done, okay? Now I'll give you a sentence of two, okay? Using yes. the infinitive of purpose, okay? Okay, let me write it first, all right? Let me for example. Can you see the letter? Can you see it? Yes. Okay. This sentence I went outside to help my mom ah. to help my mom also you can say i went outside to in order to order to help my mom Okay, can you see it? Yeah. There are two sentences. First sentence, let, please read it for me. Uh, I went I went outside to help my mom. Very good. Next sentence, please read it for me. I went outside in order to help my, my mom. Okay, yeah, very good. See, there are two sentences using in order to and the word to only, but has the same meaning, right? Now, when we say infinitive of purpose, again, used to explain why action is done. 
Now, why you went outside? Why the man or he or she went outside? Why do I went outside? I know that is the explanation to help my mom. Okay? The explanation yes. is to help my mom. Now, so in here, what is the explanation of this second sentence? Why I went outside? Mm. To help? Mm. To help my mom. Yes, okay, very good. Now, do you get it now? That is what you did. That, sorry, that is infinitive of purpose to or in order to. That explains the action. This explains the sentence. Why I went outside. Okay? This explains the action. Why I went outside. Okay? Yes. Okay, thank you for that. La I want uh, you want me to clear this or you know different clear okay i'm gonna clear it <laughs> okay let's continue now okay please an action plus two plus infirmative verb for example she is going to England. Yeah. She is going to go to England to learn business what? management. Business management. Business management. Business management. 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 Okay, business. Business. Management. 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 <laughs> Management. Okay, that's better, Tao. Okay. Now, here she is going to go to England. That is the action. Going to. Right? Going to go. Right? Yeah. Now plus the word to, and then the infinitive verb to learn English management. To learn. Okay? That is the infinitive verb. All right? To learn. All right, Tao? Yeah. Another example of this. Another I. I am. Going to Okay, can you see it? Okay, I think it's, it's a hard for you to understand this one. Uh, let me kind of okay. Another example of to learn. Okay, this one, I think it's better. Okay, now he is going to go to America to learn English language there. Okay, now the infinitive here is the word to learn. 
Okay, action, going to America. And then the infinitive is to learn, okay? Yes. Okay, now your turn, uh, Thao. Can you please give me a sentence using this pattern? An action plus do plus infinitive verb. Yes. Oh, so can you hear me? Yes. Okay, all right. Okay, uh, I'm gonna delete this one. I'm gonna delete this one so, be, so that you can write. Okay, go ahead. I am going to go to school uh, to learn and uh, to learn subject some subjects okay okay well okay the specific subject what subject is it uh, English math yes. yeah yes okay you can also say I'm going to go uh, I said you said I'm going to go to school to learn math subject yes yes okay. thank you now okay another example of infinitive verb okay the verb not just the to learn but also this example to be here in this sentence I want to be at us true astronaut <laughs> with astronaut. Okay. Now in this sentence, the infinitive verb in here is the word or the is the to be. Okay. The action or the verb here is want. All right. Okay. Now that is infinitive verb. Okay. In a sentence here, this is the verb go. And this is infinitive learn. In the sentence, want is the action action word or the verb. To be is the infinitive verb. Okay. Yes. Okay, now I'll give you an example of infinitive verbs. Okay. <clears throat> let me write it all. Okay, Tao. First, let me clear and write all. These are to be, to have, to hold. Ay, sorry. To hold. And to sleep. Ah, better walk with you. Okay. To sleep. And to, to spin. These are the infinitive verb. 
Okay. Yeah. And the sample sentence I gave to you is that I want to be an astronaut. In that sentence is the best word there to use the this infinitive verb. Let me write it again. Now, can you note this, okay, now? Two. All right, that's it. Okay, that is the example of the phonetic verb to be. Okay? Mm, yes. Okay, do you have questions? We have questions. Now, do you want an example of to have? Of to have. I'll give you an example, okay, Tao? Okay? Yeah. Okay. Now, I'll give an example, then you. Okay. Shane asked, this one, Shane asked to have the infinitive verb, to have another hamburger. Here. Okay. Now, I'll, please help me. Where is the verb in this sentence? Okay. Oh, the, yeah. Just, I'm going to delete it first. And this is wrong. Okay? Yes. Again. Shane asked to have another hamburger. Okay. Now, where is the verb in the sentence? The verb is this. Ask, okay? Right, now that the verb. That is the action of the sentence, okay? Shane is the subject. I is the subject. She is the subject in the sentence. To have is the infinitive verb. Okay? Yes. Okay. Now, do you have any questions? Mm, yes. Okay, what is? Now, what is your question? Yes, now. Oh, you message mm. oh, you in the chat, now. You message me in the chat. Where is it? Where's your question? Oh, I can't find it. Okay, now first, while I am 
waiting for that question. Let's make a sentence. Okay, Thao? Ready? Can you hear me well? Okay. Oh, Tao, I can't hear you. Hello? I'm here. Okay. Now, are you ready to make a sentence? Yes. Okay. First, use to be. Infinitive verb to be. Okay? And this, yes. is, your, this is your basis. Yo. I want to spend I want to spend mm. I want to stand here uh, waiting for my friend. Okay. I want to sp spend her here you mean each e this one how this yeah her her okay i want to spend more time her and then what else i want to spend oh, pardon me tao say it again i want to spend I want to spend her waiting for my friend. Okay, I want to spend here. Okay. I want to spend here waiting for my friend. Okay, can you please give me another? Mm. You can say, also say, I want to spend here, okay? That, that's like that, okay? Or, or you can say, I'm waiting for my friend. I want to spend more time here, okay, Tao? Mm, yes. Okay. All right, so give me an another and sample of infinitive verb. I want, I want to eat, eat this cake because I am hungry. <laughs> okay, I want to eat, I want to eat, yeah, I want to eat this, this cake. 
Okay, very good. Now, can you please write it for me, Tao? Yes. Okay, all right. A good job, Thou. Okay. Now you can also say, I want to eat the cake. Okay? Because it's much simpler. But this, but this is right. This is correct. But if you want to make a sentence, you can also make a simpler sentence. Okay? For example, I want to eat, to eat the cake. Okay? Yes. Okay. All right. Thank you, Thou. Now, let's clear this all. Let's continue. Note one. When we want to make infinitive clause negative, we use not to. Okay? For example, he changed his way not to see her. Okay, look, not to, this is negative, all right? Because of the, we use not to in the sentence, okay? Yes. Okay, very good. All right, so let's me, let's go. Number, note number, what is it, two? Please read. Read to. To can be used at the beginning of the sentence. Set. Example. Set. Example. To pass the exam, you need to study head. Okay, thank you. Now, read this word, sentences. This pronounce as sentence. Okay? Okay, thank you. Now, to pass the exam, look, this is the infinitive verb, right? To pass the exam, you need to study hard. Look, you need to study hard. You can also use to in the beginning of the sentence. Okay, Thou? Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Here, to learn business management, okay, to learn business management, she need to go to England, like that, okay? Like this sentence. We, we used to at the beginning of the sentence, okay? To learn business management, she need to go to England, okay? Just yeah. like that. Okay, thank you. Okay. Oh, is that your friend? <laughs> your friend Tao? Yeah. Is that your friend? Uh, is your friend calling? No. How oh, I see. Okay, so you have any questions about this? No. Okay, thank you. Now let's go to the next page. Okay, what is it? Please read. 
Pfizer to have other sentence. Okay, now first let's talk about this word, haves. It is the past tense of... Okay, half. All right? Yes. Now are you ready? Okay, glue when you break up the cup or plate. Two, scissors. They are usually made by metal and... Uh, three, a dictionary. When you don't understand a word, okay? Four, a bin. When something is old, you don't want it. Five, calendar. To help you to remember a special day. This, okay. Now, please finish these sentences with your own words. Using infinitive of purpose. Number one, a glue. Glue. When you break a cup or plate, Okay, for example, tau, glue. When you break up a cup or plate, you can use it to stick the broken pieces. Now here, to stick. To stick the broken pieces. Okay, that is how to answer this task. Okay, another again. When you break a cup of pl or plate, you, you you can use it to stick the broken pieces. Okay, so are you ready? Number two. Mm -hmm. They are usually made of metal and and you can use it to like this. And is to cut paper. Oh, very good. Okay, good job. Three, a dictionary. When you don't understand a word, you can use it to You can use it to know. Okay, to know some words. Okay, thank you. When you don't understand a word, you can use it to know some words. Is that your answer now? Yes, no. Yes. Okay. All right, how about number four, a bin? When something is old and you don't want it. Mm. 
you use it to throw rubbish? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good job. You use it to throw rubbish. Okay, number five. Ah, uh, calendar. To help you to remember a special day. Yes, thou. Mm, you is it mm, to see the date? The date. Okay. All right. To help you remember a special day, you can use it to. You can use it to. See the date. Uh, see the date. Okay. Now let's write all your answer from number one to number five. Okay, Thou? Okay, I'm going to write it. Help me to remember your answer. Okay? Number one, when you break a cup. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Let, okay, also number one is the answer is already there. Let's go to number five. Okay, they are usually made of metal and you can use it. To what's That's the answer? Paper. To cut through the paper. Okay, thank you. Number three, a dictionary. When you don't understand a word, you can use it. To, to know many words. Oh, many words. Okay, thank you. Now number four. When something is old and you don't want it, you can use it to, to throw rubbish here. Yeah. To throw rubbish. Okay, just throw rubbish. All right, so number number five, a calendar. Oh, a calendar to help you to remember a special day. You can use it. You can use it sorry. to see the date. To see the date. Okay, thank you, Thou. Now, please read your answer again, okay? Number two. Focus. The source. Se, se, source. Se, source. You? Se, source. They are usually made of metal and you can use it to cut the paper. Okay, now where is the infinitive verb? To? To cut. Okay, very good. Number three, please read. A dictionary. Dictionary. A dictionary. You? A dictionary. 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 Okay, again, dictionary. Dictionary. Very good, better. Continue. When you don't understand a word, you can use it to know many words. Okay, thank you. Number four. Ah. Uh, A bin. A bin. When something 
E O and you don't want it, you can use it to throw rubbish. Okay, now please listen to me again. When something is, okay, you, you, when something is. When something is old. old and you don't want it. And you, and don't, you don't want, want it. it. And you don't want it. You can, you use, can it. use You can use it to throw rubbish. Very good. Okay, better. Number five. Ah. Uh, A cylinder. Calendar. 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 To help you to remember a special day, you can use to see the day. Okay, okay. Thank you, Tao. Good job. Okay, now please uh, don't forget the infinitive verb, okay? Oh, that yes. will be your homework, okay? Good homework. Give me five infinitive clause, okay? Or in yeah. sentences using, okay. Now, I'm going to send this in our group chat, okay? Yeah. Now, now please send the homework too, okay? Our previous yeah. homework. Now, you're amazing now. Okay, don't forget this word. Go through the new grammar you've learned today and practice it, okay? Yes. Yeah. Okay, thank you for this night. Have a great night, Tao. Bye-bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Eat your dinner, too. Bye-bye. <laughs>